Speaker DeFazio says he fully supports Pelosi's decision to hold the articles until the House is confident that the Senate will hold a fair trial. DeFazio is on holiday recess and he stopped by our studios today where he spoke with KZI 9 News reporter Connor McCarthy about a number of different topics. Connor. Yeah, Renee, I sat down with DeFazio for about 30 minutes, and he touched on several topics, from impeachment to the USMCA and his committee's plans for 2020. We also talked about Boeing's decision to fire CEO Dennis Muhlenberg, something DeFazio says was clearly overdue. Muhlenberg has been at the center of the company's 737 MAX saga since March. Boeing's board of directors ousted him today as a way for customers, investors, and the government to rebuild trust with the company. DeFazio, who chairs the Transportation and Infrastructure Committee, says he lost confidence in Muhlenberg's ability to lead the company after an October hearing in Washington, D.C. I said, you know, Mr. Muhlenberg, you're not a farm boy from Iowa anymore. You're an incredibly wealthy CEO of the largest airplane manufacturer in the world. You got a $15 million bonus after the first plane went in. And I haven't seen consequences here. And I haven't seen the change that needs to be made in this organization. When it comes to impeachment, DeFazio says he voted yes because the evidence he's seen clearly points to criminal wrongdoing by President Trump. To see more of my interview with DeFazio about Boeing's CEO and impeachment and his decision to vote against the USMCA, go to KZI.com. Reporting in the studio, Connor McCarthy, KZI 9 News.